Hello and welcome to The Financial Room. I'm your host once again, Natasha Bridgemohan. Thank you for allowing me to be in your living room this morning. I hope you have the volume nice and loud because we're going to be talking about my favorite subject and I'm sure it's your favorite subject. We're going to be talking about 2022 housing market and how it's going to look like and how it's going to affect you. Some of the key, you know, economical factors that you need to, uh, you know, put aside some time to understand and if it affects you, what you need to do. The first thing is the inventory in the real estate market still is remaining very low, very, very, very scarce. Why is that happening? My friends, many, many reasons. One COVID-19 and all of the shutdowns Two because of shortages, labor shortages, production shortages, inventory shortages because of COVID-19. That's number two. And number three, housing shortage per capita for individuals who are looking for housing. There's simply just not enough inventory. So combined with all of those three mixtures can be very, 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 very competitive, which means that, uh, that there is low inventory, high demand that's pushing up these prices. So remember, how can you find uh, inventory in a very scarce market it's like looking for a needle in a haystack well pick up the phone contact us we will align you with one of our great real estate agents who can then you know work the phones work their off-market contacts network in addition to the traditional MLS that you are used to so let's talk about interest rates interest rates are going to rise our Bank of Canada has, have already set the tone uh, for what will be happening with the Bank of Canada overnight borrowing rate expect at least uh, two to three increases this year if not opening up to next year at 25 basis points so if you have a variable rate mortgage or home equity line of credit make sure that you have enough money in your bank account to compensate for that increase prices won't drop so no matter what you hear and what you are, are saying uh, what, what everyone else is saying it's okay to be a little bit nervous and, and a little bit angry about you know not being able to you know uh, buy or being outbid but the prices won't drop the, 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 the demand is just simply there my friends so how can you you know get a home and be competitive in a very pricey market in a very hot market align yourself with subject matter experts at the bridge group of companies we have the divisions ready for you from mortgages to real estate acquisition to consulting to our new and upcoming law firm in specializing in real estate and will so we got all of the subject matter experts ready uh, at a, a you know a drop of a dime to pick up the phone or meet with you and educate you and help you through na navigating through these times and of course young buy buyers are still at that high disadvantage so if you have a a family member or a sibling or a child that, that has a great job good credit but they just simply think they can't get in pick up the phone and call us. We're getting in young people into multiplexes, out of town properties, and helping them buy something to develop equity appreciation, principal uh, payment reduction, or getting them into the first time home buyer grant program, up to 70,000 free down payments. So pick up the phone and call us. You're missing out on some great opportunities. Listen, trying times will always be there. It's how you survive and how you react from it. Here at the Bridge Group of Companies, we're all about planning strategically with each and every one of our clients, sitting down, you know, crossing those T's, dotting those I's, and checking for every possible scenario where we can allow you or your loved one or a young first time home buyer to get into the housing market. Pick up the phone, it's hot, but it is waiting for you. Thank you again.